product is extremely easy to use. It is a box that you place down, you plug it in, you have the internet, um, and it flies itself. The box opens, the drone goes, it flies its own mission, comes back, charges itself, closes itself in the box. It's always measuring wind and rain, and it's got its own, it's just its own drone in a box that controls all of its environment um, and does everything autonomously. So, you know, it's got infrared cameras and, you know, it can detect fires and, and all these sorts of things. So this piece of technology is so simple to use, simple understanding, and um, for us that, you know, is not experienced, it's a plug and play. My name's Peter and we're on Delamira here where we run Sunset Hill Boar Goats and this is a family run operation along with my parents and my wife um, and we run on this two and a half thousand acre property, we run around a thousand head of, it's a mixed operation generally but um, predominantly goats um, with sheep and some cattle as well. With any operation I think whether you're small or big there's a lot of tedious jobs that need to get done. Uh, and with that in mind, you know, we're always exploring different avenues of, of making management um, more cost effective and more efficient. Uh, you know, labour cost is, is very expensive. So for us, we were exploring different opportunities and, and with that, you know, we've played with things like drones, with management softwares, with, you know, GPS tags, water monitoring systems. So we have a, a pretty good idea of, of the technologies that can benefit us. Um, and with that in mind, you know, we use that in our, in our various businesses, which is not just the farming, but the contracting off farm, which involves livestock as well. And, you know, we use electronic tags, we use auto draft systems and, and all that sort of stuff. So we're quite well, ad, you know, adept to what's going on with um, the, the technology space, but, you know, we're always looking at what's next. Um, and for us, I think some of the technology we run now has sort of made our lives easier. So before we sort of had this technology, um, which was the dock and drones and, and the various things that we use. Uh, a lot of our labour was quite manual um, and checking livestock and checking troughs and managing the landscape was all a very laborious and manual task. So we were always out, you know, having to check these things on a daily basis. It basically formed the routine of every day um, for us and our staff. Like it was, you know, we had to head out and check these things all the time. So I guess this technology has automated a lot of these tasks that are maybe not the most complicated tasks, but so important that need to get done. Um, for us, without ensuring that there's good water or the management of the animals are correct or they're not where they need to be um, and managing what the landscape looks like and observing those changes, without that being done on a regular basis, we can't create a, a quality product. I'm Conrad, I'm part of the AgTech 360 team. And yeah, we focus on bringing technology, usable technology to farmers. So our software, Agview, integrates with the DJI Docs, so the farmers have a known platform which they are used to and use every day, and now they can perform complex drone tasks automated from this single platform. On that platform, we can either um, monitor and say, like the security cameras that we have set up, if they see something, this drone will launch, it launch itself straight away, go and take an image and a video um, of what's happening, and it will log that in a live feed and in a historical database. For security, we integrate with the on-farm security cameras. We set up boundaries, virtual boundaries, so any intrusion detection will be passed onto the system. The drone can then automatically deploy and give you a live view and maybe also act as a deterrent. Um, yeah, we believe these automations will simplify and streamline farm management. The drone in the dock is what is out there basically being you. It's collecting the information, it's doing those tasks, that it's, it's picking up on all the little things that you may have missed, it's ensuring that everything is up to scratch, animals are where they need to be, fence lines are correct, water is, you know, good. Um, these things are important, but as I mentioned, biosecurity, we need to know who comes in and out of this gate at all times. If something happens here, it affects our whole business and the whole supply chain. The 
The doc's return on investment on our operation is probably most likely equivalent to, um, you know, one day's labour a week. Um, but I would assume, and it's just an assumption, but on a, on a larger scale operation, I could imagine that it would be up to one full labour unit per year um, with the amount of uh, operation that it can do. This product is extremely easy to use. It is a box that you place down, you plug it in, you have internet, um, and it flies itself. The box opens, the drone goes, it flies its own mission, comes back, charges itself, closes itself in the box. It's always measuring wind and rain, and it's got its own, it's just its own drone in a box that controls all of its environment um, and does everything autonomously. So, you know, it's got infrared cameras and, you know, can detect fires and, and all these sorts of things. So this piece of technology is so simple to use, simple understanding, and um, for us that, you know, is not experienced, it's a plug and play.